Greetings everyone And I welcome you all back to even more of my Dragon Age 2 adventures with Artemy Hawk. So last time we've performed a couple of the minor quests in a different way and I gotta say I absolutely did not like doing it this way but you know back then I thought since we are in a kind of urgent situation I thought let it be just over with and do it is this way but yeah, I promise I will make sure to avoid such things in the future, since it absolutely ruins my perception of the game. And now I know I did not expect to say that, but welcome to part 3 of uh, finishing all of the minor quests. And thankfully we have only two of them left. like inside the job and forbidden knowledge like I still have no idea where this book is I avoided the attempt to look this one up as well so like let's be over with that job really quickly and make sure everything other than that is done and if this tome doesn't pop up anywhere looks like we're gonna be uh, going into another look uh, looking venture so for that matter I think we will bring that team because I think right now Evelyn is a bit busy with her captain duties, so I'll leave, I'll leave her be, like, for now. But, you know, it depends on what kind of job we are talking about. But thus far, this is, like, the break I feel most confident with, like, just very maybe variating um, Avalyn, um, Fenris, and Varric, like whatever combination is. But as for Meryl, she ca she's kind of becoming uh, almost a permanent uh, gear of mine, if I can put it this way. Ah, right, the miner. You got my letter. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this, and I did. Now, after a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. One of our miners, Sabine, has been leaking information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown in Ferelden. Mm. I would like you to get this festering sore to divulge who is behind the thefts. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. Ah, is he from the Lothering? Who is this man? I would not expect you to recall every piss pot from your past. That's the problem with being a big fish in a small pond. I could never tell the little fish apart. Well, he brags to his fellows that he grew up with you in Lothering. Ah, really? Okay, then. Bring Sabine back to my place. Excellent idea. I will get him now. Let's see what's going on exactly. And as soon as I left my place, we are going back there yet yet again. But yeah, doing all the business is a Here bit is of the dung pile I caught leaking next week's shipment schedule. He won't tell me who is working with. Who else has been screwing <coughs> me over? Tell me, you ratting mongrel! Yeah, like, you know, me as the um, pro-templar, I still, like, you know, I understand that 
I kinda dropped the illusion that all the Templars are good and that's the reason why I'm trying to make the place better for the Templars and for the mages. So I'm I'll I'll try my best to avoid unnecessary violence. And you know, I specifically underline the world the word unnecessary in it. And you know even if it's not a major Templar situation, I just see no need to be violent here. He can't talk with a mouthful of broken teeth. Please, Miss Sir, help me. I knew you since you was young and lothering. I knew your mum's family and your pop. Mike, you got him rest. Pathetic. I leave this bastard in your capable hands. Get me when he's ready to talk. Thank you, Monsieur. Us slothering folk should stick together. Yeah, why did you do this? What made you betray your employer? Before the blight, my family had a good life in Lothering. Clean home, fertile land, friends, and cook while well, we lived in a hovel. People spit on us, and some days we went hungry. Hmm. Yeah, I know what you mean exactly. I know it was hard to leave Lothering. Talk to me so we can put all this behind us. As soon as I tell you what he wants to know, he'll kill me or throw me in prison. My life's not worth much but my family. I only wanted to give my wife and son a better life. Hmm. Can you pay him back? Hubert's first love is gold. You must have some squirreled away. I'll tuck some coin away for the future. But if it buys me a future out of prison, Hubert can have it. Hawk, this is Lily of the Coterie. Given the importance of stopping the cargo robberies, I have enlisted a consultant. Consultant? Sure. Whatever helps you sleep at night. Well, Doug, are you ready to bark now? There's an ambush. Planned tonight at Dietrich Crossing. Tonight? That leaves you barely enough time to intercept them. You had best leave immediately. We'll protect your precious shipment. But make sure you have the Coterie's payment. Want me to deal with this runt? Free of charge. I'll drop him in a ditch on our way out. Yes, take him. With my blessing. I assume my partner will not object. Hmm. I'm just trying to get in into the shoes of this Ferelden guy. I'll pay I'll pay off his debt. Sabine will pay you back if you let him go. Oh really? I'm more inclined to beat the coin out of this sheep's swallop and then kill him. He's nothing, you bear. Take his offer and cut him loose so we can get back to business. Fine. Get me your ill-gotten coin before I change my mind. Oh, thank you, Miss Ayers. I know I don't deserve it, but thank you. We're wasting time. If you find naught but corpses at the ambush, it won't be my fault. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's take over this ambush situation really quickly. But yeah, that's what I think is the best uh, thing my hawk would do. We're too late for your boys, but we'll make the rotters pay. Okay. Frame rate. I really wish you would cooperate with me. There is simply not much of the location or enemies in there just come on game there is absolutely no reason for you to behave this way I 
I just don't understand what's causing this. That was almost too easy. Wait, I recognize that lout. Who is he? He's in the coterie. One of that damned fool Brecker's men. And he is... Tell me about this man. He operates out of the south side. Always had more balls than sense. His lackeys are loyal. Brecker must be involved. Well, I think it's time for us to meet him. Let's pay Brecker a social call. We've got a lot to talk about. I've got to be sure first. I know who to lean on to get answers. Find me in the Undercity. Okay... Just, l just let's make sure that we are not missing anything and it doesn't look like to be this way. Well, in that case, let us actually leave and see exactly Yeah, I would prefer doing anything during the day. The nights are still, you know, quite a lot of low life uh, walking around. And, you know, last time I already have performed quite a genocide. Like, seriously, uh, I'm still, I'm honestly surprised that with all the genocide I've performed, I'm still walking around and not in a prison. I almost feel like a politician. No pun intended. In any ways... Let's see exactly what... Ah, that was fast. Don't let them get away! You coterie, one of Lily's friends. Lily was one of ours. She was working for you, and now she's dead. You get one chance. Did you kill her? Well, no reason to be violent. She was dead when I got here. Lily didn't die by my hand. Someone else did this. Explain yourself. Sheesh. It's not my fault, eh? This is a case of the right hand not knowing what the left is doing. One of the scum that attacked my caravans worked for someone in the coterie named Brecker. Lily said she'd look into it. I think Brecker had her killed. Brecker? Hmm. If you're lying, I'll find you. Men, we have to get to the bottom of this. Now. So, now what? Okay, well, for some reason, I, you know, I thought it would be something related to dragons, you know, since it was the Hubert guy, uh, and last time it was a dragon problem, so I thought maybe it would be, once again, something related to the dragon case. Okay, bring them all up here. Uh, ow! Sheesh! 
That scared the shit out of me here. Oh, and probably... I agree. Varric, you go... first. At least it would give me... Uh, a bit more safety. Oh, Meryl. If you please. Meryl? I'm not sure if that worked. I'm just staying concentrated, sorry guys. Come on, you're not wor you're not worth my time. Just let's get it over with. So I didn't quite understand if the uh, dispel worked on this mage's bubble. I like I saw some, you know, uh, bluish uh, black flame glittering, but I didn't understand if uh, it just the bubble ran out or I actually dispel it. So please tell me. You must be Brecker. And you're that lice-covered refugee. Well, you're not yet. You're not getting away with attacking my shipments. Hope you enjoyed saying that. Those are the last words you'll ever speak. Okay, how about we bring you all up here? I think I messed up my POV just a bit. Got some balls here, I see. Ah, come on, what? I think we should start concentrating on one enemy at a time. Yeah, you need something like real good. Something like that. Mm, 
No, you don't. I knew you were hiding here. No. Okay, so just report back. Got it. 